Good Sunday morning. <clears throat> I did not do a Sunday sit down last week because I wasn't home. I stayed the night at my sister's, so I wasn't here to weigh in Sunday morning. Um, the stress that I've mentioned before that really does me in, it's in my life again. So the scale of for several weeks basically has just been up down up down up down just sitting at the very very low 300s and then Tuesday morning I got on the scale Tuesday whatever Thursday Thursday morning I got on the scale and it said 300 point Zero. And then Friday morning happened. Hi. Long time. No record. Um, I haven't quit. I have just been absurdly busy since I got home from my little extended hiking weekend, which I haven't even compiled all that video still, and it's been, what, two weeks? Whatever. I work. A lot. And this is where I work. So when I do my Sunday sit-downs and I'm constantly not looking at the camera, it's because I'm always looking out that big window at the backyard. Anyway, <clears throat> I have been working since I got home from the trip sitting at this stupid desk all day every day from like 8 a.m. to well after midnight and it's taken a toll like my legs my feet I'm feeling it I'm feeling it significantly there was one day where I went to timber stuff but Here's the other thing, and probably why I'm taking a minute to record. It has taken me a month to finally lose that last few pounds of the 300s. Yesterday I got on the scale, and mother F, it was 300.0. <sighs> this morning, 299. Point M and F and six. <sighs> yeah. Uh oh. Incoming. <sighs> so yeah. Sorry, my brother popped in. He likes to eat his lunch on my back patio. So two ninety nine point six. It has finally happened. This is monumental and the next significant milestone that I'm shooting for is 260 someday I will explain why 260 but not today not today I've also been busy starting a new business I hope <clears throat> That's the logo for it, actually. More on that later, but I'm really freaking excited about it. Okay, 299.6, and I'm getting back to work. Seriously, that happened. And I like to not officially count it, until my Sunday weigh-in and so I got on the scale this morning hoping that my first significant milestone was legitimately reached because I don't know if I've talked about this before but back when I was 25 
I said I was going to get under 300 for my 26th birthday. I got on the scale on my 26th birthday and it said 299. That was the one and only time I saw it. My weight went right back up after that. So I don't feel like I was ever even legitimately in the 200s. I feel like I was just window shopping and never really purchased. So this morning when I got on the scale, I really wanted it. I won't say need because it's not like, screw you keto, I'm not doing this anymore if I don't get it because I need it. No, I just, I've been plugging away even though I wasn't getting there for all the weeks. So I got in there this morning, 298.8. Guys, this is the lowest I have ever weighed in my entire adult life. I am not entirely sure what to do with that. Like, I feel like it isn't even sinking in quite yet. That I am not a 300 pound person anymore. My whole identity and adult existence, I've been a 300 pound person. 300 and something pound person. So now what? It's bizarre. It's surreal. It's effing awesome but it's not quite sunk in but it's okay cuz I'm staying here I'm not going back up so I've got plenty of time to get used to it that's about all I've got today I've reached my first big milestone I'm ready for the next one, which I'm averaging about 10 pounds down a month. I'm sure if I'd stop being such a stress ball that that would be more, but I could reach that next milestone by like three months from now, three or four months from, from now. That is mental. And I want to lose 100 pounds for the year. I'm a little behind pace. But if I get to 250 by the end of the year, I will have lost 100 pounds this year. That would be easier to do if I wasn't sitting at this desk working 16 hours a day. Okay, I gotta go because... I have more work to do. I'm really trying to get the the extended weekend video done. I spent the bulk of the morning, the entire morning, it's almost one o'clock, I spent the entire morning editing that. Only to realize I never really came home and talked about the trip. I never <laughs> did a recap. So we don't care. I'm just editing it together. It's good. I just need to put in the names of the different places so you know what it was when you see it. Um, and now I have to edit this. And did I mention I'm starting a new business? Oh my god, I'm so excited. It takes like all these little passions of mine chucks them together into one hopefully kick-ass endeavor and if this could be my gig my career my thing till the end of my days I feel like I would be the happiest human happiest human 
Anyway, I finished my brand for the business yesterday. That is convenient. When you have this entrepreneurial spirit and you want to start all these little side hustles, you don't need to hire somebody to do your logo and your brand and your business cards and your everything because that's what I do. So... I have, I have determined the brand aesthetic. I geeked out hard on that project and I'm so happy with it. So happy with it. Okay, I gotta go. Bye.